been inducted into Halls of Fame. I'm curious, as you wear you know, maize and blue here on this red carpet, how special is this one for you? I think knowing that, that this was, um, I, I really, really left a great place at West Virginia to come to Michigan with a lot on the line. And it didn't look so good at the beginning, Brad. Those are the fir three uh, first years were rough. And knowing that it, we, we could turn it around in those last nine years uh, were, were so good that um, it really feels special. And then I, I, I did today, I went through all the Hall of Fame members. Oh my God. I mean, there's some of the greatest athletes in the world yeah. in all the different sports, some of the greatest coaches in the world in many different sports. To be included with that, that's, that's special. You're, I mean, you're among them, right? And you know, these plaques over here of some of those, and I know you'll probably go take a look at some of them. Do you allow yourself to soak in and realize, my goodness, my name will be on this list, and someone will look at that next year and say, I'm in with John Beeline. <laughs> I, I hope I hope so. I mean, I I have trouble with that of sort of staying in the present and, re and recognizing these moments of achievement uh, because it's always on to something else. But um, I think as as I as I continue to to get in the twilight of my career here, I have to sit down and recognize it more and and say, you know what? A lot of people were involved in this. We worked hard and happy the way it's all turned out. The way that you came in and you said that those first few years, there weren't necessarily Final Fours coming right out of the gate, but the, the players that, that you turned into stars and all of a sudden household names in Michigan, that hadn't happened for a long time for Michigan basketball. How special are those memories with those classes of guys, especially in the early going and then when you made those title game runs? Yeah, I, we went and uh, I went to a, a, a wedding recently, Josh Bartlestein's wedding, yeah. and to go there with, with him and be with, with him and of course, Tim Hardaway was there. Spike Albright was was there. Jordan Morgan was there. Um, it was it was really special to go and be a part of that. Those were the original. Zach Novak couldn't make it because his wife was expecting. Though I talked to Stu Douglas the other day. Those were the building blocks that when people see that Final Four teams, and of course Timmy was on that one of those teams. But those other guys kept me sane and also helped us just you know move up a couple levels so we could make the NCAA tournament on a regular basis and then allowed us to make runs later on. I know how proud of a grandfather you are and so maybe some of those early wins and some of those runs the younger grandkids didn't get yeah. to see. Yeah. Do they understand that grandpa's going into Hall of Fame tonight and he made his mark? Is there conversations like that at some family barbecues well, this summer? Yeah. Well, I, I did have uh, two of my grandsons uh, call me today and uh, and, and for, or it called me and just to congratulate. I don't know if they know what's going on. I think the other ones did, but they got to be enough just to realize. I mean, they were in LA when we we ended up beating Florida State to go to the Final Four, and they've been to a couple Final Fours. And actually, they were in Wichita State crying before Jordan Poole hit that shot. So they do realize there was some sec success here. I know they miss their daddy uh, coaching college or their grandpa or poppy coaching college basketball, but you know. Uh, their poppy doesn't miss it. <laughs> so, I, I, I miss. I, I really missed March. When March comes along, yeah. that was special time for me. Uh, so I, that's what I miss. Uh, I, lo I love what I do with the Detroit Pistons right now. Uh, that's that was the next move for me to make, uh, and I, I'm happy we did it. I see so many of that Pistons family here with you. Go enjoy the night. Congratulations. Thanks, Brad. Thank, Thank you so much. How about a big round of applause for this entire class? The 65th induction class into the Michigan Sports Hall of Fame.